The Smithsonian's digital team is conducting the biggest photo shoot in the history of the National Air and Space Museum. By the end of the scanning process, how many pictures do you think you will have taken? We estimate that we will have taken between 5,000 and 10,000 50 megapixel images of the shuttle. Designers are putting the pictures together to create a 3D scan of the space shuttle Discovery. It will look similar to this finished scan of the Apollo command module, but the Discovery project will detail the entire spacecraft. At 124 feet long and over 50 feet tall, that requires some heavy lifting. The goal of this project is to document this object using 3D measurement tools and then deliver that to the public. So schools can 3D print this object, they can view it online, and they'll also be able to uh, view it in virtual reality. Museum visitors can only see the shuttle from the outside, but the 3D version will allow them to explore inside too. Valerie Neal curates all the shuttle exhibits. By picking up all the nuances of color and shape and texture, they are going to bring this space shuttle to life. The team has also completed scans of a T-Rex dinosaur. Be illuminated by 10 different lighting conditions. And this portrait of President Obama used to create a bust. The discovery is the largest object yet, aiming to deliver a 3D experience that's out of this world. Weijia Jiang, CBS News, Chantilly, Virginia.